for the fun stuff you've all been waiting for. A paper plate. Oh boy. <laughs> oh yes. This will be fun. <sighs> we get so, hand sanitizer. So there's this. So more of the crap they gave me on the airplane. So we're going to feed this shit to my kid. So cranberry orange flat top muffin. I had this in my jacket most of the show, so it got crushed a little bit. <laughs> but uh, Let me see that. I didn't have access to any place to put it. Sure, sure, sure you did. So I'll even try a little bit too. I'm eating on camera. You know how rare that is? You're feeding me scraps. Mm-hmm. Hang on, hang on. I know, I know. It's crumbly. Oh, it's not that. It's, we gotta... I know. Switch over to him. What, did you change how you were sitting? Yes. The camera was fine. What the hell did you do? <laughs> there you go. There. Stop fucking around. But that's my middle name. Juan, fuck around, Cozy. Mm -hmm. Okay, eat your damn muffin. You will regret this. It's very crumbly. It is. Very crumbly and spongy. And spongy? It's like eating a lemon flavored sponge. I mean, sponge. I can't talk. Oh, I've done that for years. This looks like pretzel bits. <laughs> Just give you your crumbs back. Okay. So that's him. Why is he red faced? Oh my god, I am. <laughs> Probably because he's blushing. So, next oh, up. Apparently, I'm not good at looking. We have the Love and Quiche's Caramel Brownie. This one actually sounds like it'll probably taste a little better. Eh. Oh, someone's here. Never mind. It's just refreshing, that's why. Mm. That's right for the knife. <laughs> Mira says, wow, rare meat eating moments. We should be clipped, wool. And Kevin says, why is he so red faced? Um, he's, he's red faced because I just beat the shit out of him. You know, to get him on camera. <laughs> You're gonna eat these damn So this is, this one is a uh, brownie. By the way, guys, we have Swedish candy for him to try, which everybody I saw make the Swedish candy made a whole slew of variety types of faces, expressions, whether they liked it or hated it. It was kind of interesting to watch. So uh, we're gonna have fun with that in a second. So you'll love it, trust me. I'm still eating this because it's still good. And of course you took part of the too. Oh, I'll get more down here if you want it. I'm just not giving it all to you right now. That's actually really good. So that's a brownie. Just a regular good old fashioned brownie. Yeah, it tastes like a brownie. I'm sure it tastes like a brownie. It's a fucking brownie. I'd be more impressed if it was shaped like an apple and it tasted like a brownie. Okay. No, it tastes like the brownies that I gorged myself on. Did you gorge yourself on? Yeah, remember that party? Oh, yeah. When you had the... <laughs> oh, stream starting soon. Oh, I hit the wrong button. <laughs> Hang on, give me a second. I was <laughs> clicking on stream stuff and trying to grab him a water simultaneously. That <laughs> Wrong scene. Sorry. <laughs> Here. Giving him some water because I'm listening to him kind of choke this shit down. So, uh, next up... Appleberry Medley Nature Box. Dried cranberries, apples, and blueberries. Funny thing is, is that I looked in there, all I saw was like granola and oats and stuff. So. I don't like that. I guess, no, I guess those aren't, that's apples. Okay. So this will be interesting. So this is some kind of a weird shit that they gave me on the uh, airplane. So this is United Airlines, by the way. Oh, not United, but American <laughs> Airlines. Because United Airlines likes to punch you in the face, and uh, <laughs> First we this isn't going to get much prettier, so I don't want people punching me in the face. Welcome to United Airlines. How tough are you? Do me a favor. Put the lid back on your water. Don't leave it open like that. You saw nothing. Yeah, well, you're next to electronic equipment. Put your fucking lid on your water. You saw nothing. Um, That's cheating. What? Nothing. Just finish eating that. 
It's it's something we're we're, we're going to snack on, but we're not going to do it live on camera because it's kind of pointless too. What? It's a fucking Twix bar. <laughs> okay, so what do you think of this food? Review it. Come on, Gordon Ramsay, tell us how. Guess I should try something. Dried apple. Like, there's nothing that interesting. It's just dried apple bits, and also, it feels like a sponge. Again, freaking sweet. The Swedish with their spongy food. This isn't Swedish. This is American Airlines. Oh. But freaking Americans with their spongy food. <laughs> freaking American Airlines. I taste this. It it's I just tried some. Oh. You know what I mean by like it tastes spongy? Fungy. Spongy. I said spongy. I heard him say fungy, guys. Okay, so yeah, it is it's it's slightly rubberish. So okay. The raisins and the, I don't know what these Crazy, are. Ra raisins and cranberries. Raisins and cranberries. Mm-hmm. They're good, but I just don't like the spongy apple. Pardon me as I walk behind the camera. Half the audience would turn to stone. Another plate? Well I want to get another plate so I can prep food while you're stuck in your face. It'll make this go a lot faster. I'm just gonna do this. It's the stuff I don't finish, I'll just eat at like grand finale. In a grand finale, Grant, we'll just have a bowl over there, and we'll just throw all the leftovers each serving. So next up is uh, British Airways actually gave me a box that was sealed, and I just cracked it open. It's a burger. And it comes with sweet and salty popcorn. That's kind of cool. So this I know he'll like. So, that one's kind of cheating. He's going to love that. Ah, shit, it's like Cracker Jacks. Oh, yeah, it's totally Cracker Jacks. <laughs> and then there's something called Corkers. What corkers. the fuck's a corker? Hand-cooked crisps. Oh. I think this is simply sea salt. Awesome. Okay, I so think these are potato chips. chips. Yeah. Give me popcorn suitable chips. for vegans. Suitable. <laughs> <laughs> that reminds me of, like, your toilet paper says so suitable for septic systems. Yeah, suitable for vegans. <laughs> So if it you're a vegan cause, out there, it will cause outrage. This is murder. This is murder. I don't care. It's potato slaughter. It's potato slaughter. Potato life. Yep, matter. it's chips. It's potato chips. Well, it, I, that's a dead giveaway when it said crisps. Yep. Um, I'm gonna eat one. Those aren't bad tasting, actually. Kind of good. Here you go. I'm not eating it yet. Hang on, don't eat yet. Let me change the camera. I'm not okay. Let's watch him stuff his face, kids. That was fun. Yeah. Um, Cracker Jack tasting thing, I guess. It does taste like a Cracker Jack. Totally potato. tastes like a Cracker Jack. Vegan friendly potato chip. Slightly salted. Hey, the uh, popcorn, by the way, is gluten free. Yes, gluten lies matter too. Gluten lives matter. Wait, wrong hand. So, what's your uh, consensus on that food? It's regular old American pop. Uh, Popcorn and crisps, straight from the UK. Okay, so the Twix bar. I'm not gonna feed him. <laughs> That's like we have these all over the fucking states. That's. I'm giving him stuff he's never had before. Mm. So, Swedish candy. <laughs> the chips and popcorn I had before. I'll tell you that much. Yeah, but not this brand. It was, you know, it was UK stuff. So this, this looks like a Swedish Kit Kat. this to the pile of um, debris yes. you still need to eat. So this bar is called let me dump all that out so I can get all on my art table. Kex. K-E-X. I have no clue how to pronounce that but uh, there you go. It's from Cloetta. What, do you need another debris field plate? Just so there's one for debris so I don't have to put... Actually here, we're going to put all the Swedish candy on one thing. 
I did. So this is Black Salt Lake If you know what this is, shut up. Black Salt Lake Crits. That's what it says. Salt Lake Crits. Lake Crits. Yeah, it's very French sounding. Lake Crits. Mm -hmm. So, uh... Lake Crits, right? So yeah, something like that. Maker? <laughs> oh, yeah. So, I am already hungry. give you a couple of those to eat. I'm not a dog, don't feed me that last part. Most of you guys are chocolate, but I don't really have before. <laughs> just trying stuff in the breed right now. And then of course I also picked up super salt. Super is that just pure salt? No. Okay. No no no, it's not. <laughs> just they just they just call it that. Okay. okay, so eat the wafer. Um Jonah says salty black licorice, the best candy in the world if you are Swedish. So so the order you're gonna eat it is that one, that one. Like eat those, eat those, eat that. Okay. And one second while I turn the camera back on. Oh, this is a wafer. That's what they said. So what's the first Kit part? Kat. Oh, yeah. Looks like a Kit Kat. So uh, no, it doesn't. It's this is the Kex bar. Looks like a Kit Kat. It doesn't break like one. <laughs> Breaks a little bit more messy. Got like peanut butter or something in it too. Tastes kind of good. There we go. Um, M, what are those? The, I don't remember. <laughs> I, have the, I have the memory of a stereotypical goldfish. What was the second item? Uh, that's the salt and crisps. What's that? Are you trying to? Are you trying to speak in French? Yes. And as Jonah said, salty black licorice. <sighs> what did you think of the salt licorice stuff? Good. Really? Mm -hmm. Okay. Salty black licorice. It's still in my mouth. I'm not joking. Oh, the chocolate, the salt licorice stuff. <clears throat> okay. So yeah, when you're done with that, you get the salty. It's good, black licorice. but what the chocolate one? It lingers way too much in your mouth. And it then lingers. <laughs> it's like it good, but it lingers. <laughs> Do I have to try this? <laughs> eat, eat at least one whole piece. I did. Uh, it's rubbery. <laughs> it's rubbery. I don't like this. <laughs> so, I saved the best for last. Almost. I actually have British chocolate over here too. I picked up on the way home. Oh God, the juice hit. <laughs> the juice hit. <laughs> it's not with my saliva. Just like, hey, look, wow. there's a tongue. Yeah. So what he's eating right now is salt, salt saturated, like salt dipped, salt coated, salt flavored black licorice. Who needs a cyanide pill? You got this. It's like one of the nastiest things I've ever put in my mouth. <laughs> when I was in the Marine Corps. Not like the Navy. Those guys have put some really nasty things in their mouths. Mostly on cold, lonely nights at sea. Um. <laughs> Do I have to put this in the debris field? Yeah, you get to finish it. I had to eat it. I'm surprised you like the uh, the other one. You know what? Screw this. I'm not having this in the debris field. Oh, you're just going to go for it. All right. That's balls, man. Um, let's see. Does Rainbow Kappa. Jonah says, ha ha. Can I flip him off? What's that? Can I flip Jonah off? No. <coughs> the salt hit. Mm hmm. Ugh. What's it candy called? Super salt. If you guys want to see, want to taste the, the feeling of the Overwatch community. Just pop one of these in your mouth. Ah. I put two in there. It's like Team Fortress 2 um, community now. Ah. I have no clue what he's trying to say. There's so much salt. <laughs> when you're when you're done choking on that. 
Have those. Oh, uh, yeah, I always want Dick Spend. <laughs> Wait, is that what it says? Wow, it does. Dick's Bend. It said, actually, it says. Dick's Bend. It says Bendix, but because you're getting half of one, it said Dick's Bend. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so the logo wraps around it. That's pretty funny. I didn't actually see that, so. Yeah, I always it. love Dick's Bend. <sighs> it looks like a thin man. It is. Yeah. So th this is reward for making him choke down. This is a yolk tournament fatty. Okay. So I just, I got him actual good chocolate. And there's another one if you want me to show it. Nah, you're good. It's just people have seen people enjoy regular chocolate before. So So you decided to put me through black licorice. Oh, yeah. I'm surprised. Like, off camera, by the way, I tried the uh, the chocolate and black licorice one. He took it a lot better than I did. He was like, that's not bad. I'm just like, this is salty as shit. Yeah, oh. that, that, that super salt thing you ate. Oh, but... The chocolate is the same thing in there. Also, it tastes like it's got, like, Rice Krispies or something in it, too. So Honestly, crispy. it was covered in chocolate, so I didn't notice. Yeah. But He's but like, hmm, I've got chocolate in my mouth. I'm good now. Life is good. I'm not going to taste anything for a while, because this is mint. Yeah, so... I'm checking there, there you go. Cool. There you go. I, I flushed the nasty out of his system, or at least out of his mouth, at least. Yeah. Nope, it's still ruining my stomach. This <laughs> <laughs> is going to be... Here you go. I'll help with your diabetic coma later. <laughs> Yay, apple sponge. Giving him the rest of the spongy apple stuff so I can throw these wrappers away. Okay, so while I was in Sweden, I drew this. Ah, there's a little bit of licorice stuck, stuck in my mouth now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's the best part. Like two hours later, you'll be like, why do I still taste it? Because it's clinging to your teeth. <laughs> it's got like a death grip on your molars. That shit just doesn't let go. I think that's why the Swedes like it. It's like you can go long periods between meals, and they just like you know what, you know. Just explore my mouth. For back in bit. the days when it was like Ice Age, frozen Sweden, I bet that was something. They're like, you know what, just put this in your mouth. You'll taste it for weeks. No, and it'll keep you from getting hungry. Oh, I did forget to show one last thing. Our fantastic host, Jonas, otherwise known as Jonah F. Stock, actually gave me a bottle of Polish uh, vodka, orange flavored. I wish I could tell you more about it, but it's all in freaking Polish. So, everything. Tell us, Jonah. I will tell you this, though. It is 72 proof. Good time. Nice. Oh, my God. <sighs> hang on. Bros. Hang on, hang on. Oops. Mouse is upside down. One sec. Yeah. No, my no, this face froze on my oh. computer. <laughs> this looks... Oh, I, was, I was watching your face freeze. You, you were just like... <laughs> wow. 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 It's just, it, I, it still tastes licorice. Uh, that was awesome, though. Oh, yeah, that licorice stuff was nasty. I couldn't get Emily to eat it. I tried. <laughs> she watched my face eating it. It was all like, I'm not putting that in my mouth. And uh, just regular chocolate. This is just regular chocolate. Tiny bar. Yeah, I just I gave you just pure chocolate and some mint chocolate just to essentially I'm trying to de louse your your taste buds, which I just put through hell. So but anyways, so that's a fourteen year old eating Swedish candy. <laughs> and by the way, just a reminder, everybody, if you sub this month, you get half off. So do it. <laughs> oh yeah, and the the other thing is uh, we went to IKEA. And I picked up a cheese slicer. Why is this so awesome? Because this one actually says made in Sweden. The one I'm, I'm pretty sure the one we bought from Ikea here in the States actually says made in China. So I was really kind of giggling that this one says made in Sweden. So. Uh, well, our goods aren't exactly quality. It was one of the highlights of our trip was uh, actually taking uh, Emily, who's never been to an Ikea, I was like, you know what, fuck it, let's take her to a Swedish Ikea. Wow. Then we'll take her to the regular one. So we did have the meatballs there, by the way. The meatballs at the Swedish Ikea, identical to the ones at the American Ikea. It's, you know, it's the same horse meat. Um, the, uh, yeah, the same human child. The <laughs> Supplied by the same orphanage. Um, but oh. the, um, 
but the, uh, uh, the the meatballs that Jonah made us, so that Yunus made us, were freaking awesome. So the 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 Swedish made homemade meatballs, the Swedish homemade meatballs, freaking amazing. The ones at IKEA, they're just the ones at IKEA. So a little bland, frozen tasting, but yeah. So whether you're in Sweden or England or the United States, it's gonna taste the damn thing, same if you eat IKEA meatballs. Um, anyways, so this is a picture I did at the uh, Stockholm Comic Con, which looks horribly out of focus now that I'm looking at it. There we go. Is that the one you finished up, or? Yeah, I drew this at. Con I, I, I started it on stream, and then I took it to uh, Stockholm and finished it there. Nice. So I just wanted to show it to everybody because I don't think anybody saw it. So, pow. Um, I said screw you, Jonah. Screw two. Oh. You. And then Jonah.